Assalamu alaikum everyone. So um, today I'm going to um, show you how to register for the uh, conference and um, it's basically pretty simple. All we're going to do is um, we're going to actually uh, go ahead and click the register now button and then after that it's going to ask you to um, log in if you have a profile or sign up. You just click on sign up to um, create a new account for this year. Now you'll be presented with a screen here to fill out your uh, sign up information, basically username, email, and password. And you can go ahead and fill that out here or you can just log in using your social um, account. So like Facebook in this case, I clicked on Facebook it imports your profile and then it's going to ask you if you have an existing account or a new account. It's a new account you're setting up so you're going to say uh, use a new account and then you're going to put in your email address that you want to associate it with. And then you'll hit confirm. And this is going to link your account and you'll see this pop over here that says this is an invitation only event. So basically we're asking you to fill out all your information. However, um, this does not guarantee your acceptance. So you fill out the information, including your payment information. And then if your registration is approved, um, you know, you will have a final confirmation. So we'll go ahead and uh, fill out all the necessary details here. So I'm going to go ahead and um, close this uh, popover and then you're going to go ahead and fill out the form with your first name and last name, um, whether or not you're presenting a speech, your email, and your phone number. Now, the phone number is important in case, you know, we need to get hold of you at some point, let's say if you're presenting a speech. Uh, and make sure the email address is the same as the email address that uh, you know you have used to sign up earlier. So put in the same email address. Then there's also this question about how you hear about the conference, how you heard about it, and that's basically important for us to know because we want to make sure you know the person who is coming to the conference is a submitter, since the submitter's conference and will help us evaluate your uh, registration uh, correctly. So I'm just going to go ahead and, and fill out some information here. So the next thing we want to know is if you're um, volunteering for anything, let's say you want to deliver a sermon or you want to be the MC or lead one of the contact prayers or you know work at the registration desk, Etc. I mean, you let us know, and we we basically accommodate that. So if you or any of your members, family members, are participating in any of this, just let us know uh, in this box. And here you fill out all the information about all your dependents that will be coming in with you so you know your wife your kids your husband whatever and um you know whether or not they're presenting a speech then we continue on to the next step At this stage, you know, you're going to be presented with two options. You can either uh, pay online now or you can pay later by check. Uh, if you hit the pay now button, uh, that will uh, take you to the online payment section where you can, you know, put in the quantities of the tickets you're trying to purchase. Say I'm purchasing two for adults and one for a child. And so I add them to the cart individually. And then you can click on the view cart from there, or you can verify it from the button up top. And the cart 
icon and you can see it basically you know verify the quantities and then hit checkout and at this point you're going to be presented with the credit card information uh, form for your checkout where you fill in all your details for your billing address and then your actual credit card details so you hit continue to payment and this is just you're going to enter in your credit card number and your expiration and your CVV number at the back of your card and hit pay now and then you're done basically you know this is the end of your registration and at this point you can submit your speech if you're planning to speak uh, submission outline uh, you could also you know do that later if you don't have it now but uh, it's good that you submit it earlier so we can uh, know ahead of time what you're planning to speak about so in about uh, 24 to 48 hours your application to attend the conference will be evaluated uh, and if it's approved you'll receive an email that looks like this and it will have um, a link for the hotel uh, information and if you click on it it will ask you to log back in if you're logged out and I'm gonna log in just by clicking on my Facebook icon in this case and it's gonna log me back in otherwise you can put in your username and password and it'll log you in now at this point you'll be presented with the screen for uh, logging you into the hotel website so you click on the book hotel button that will be at the bottom of the page and it will take you to the hotel information and from there on you can book the room and that's it you're all set once your room is booked and we'll look forward to seeing you at the conference